Smithsonian National Museum of Natural History. This is the first annual Bug Fest. Uh, well, we're showing people that um, eating insects is something that's quite reasonable and they taste and they actually taste good. Um, the scenario is everybody eats everybody eats um, lobster and uh, crab and uh, uh, various other arthropods. Why not eat insects? And so uh, what we're doing is giving a couple of different ways that you can eat insects. There are lots of different ways, but we've got just a couple of different ways here for them. Certainly full of a lot of protein, uh, but I, I really don't have a a figure on that. Okay. They have done nutritional studies on them because yeah. there are lots of there are lots of places where they eat insects all the time. Africa, for example, is a place where there's not a whole lot of protein. I mean, protein is a very difficult commodity to get a hold of. So insects are a wonderful source of protein there. Mixing up a cheese dip, and we're going to have cricket nachos. We're going to have uh, tortilla chips and then cheese topping, and then fried crickets on top. Of it. And they're really quite delicious. That young man there is going to be just anxious to have some. Have a meal warm cookie. <laughs> what young man? He we disappeared. First, we first fixed these uh, at the Insect Expo at the Enological Society of America meeting in Dallas uh, last December. Yummy. And we had about 3,000 grade school children come through. And it was amazing. We had more children and teaching and teachers eating cricket nachos than we did in a <laughs> Those are the kind I like. These are good ones, I'll tell you. These are some of the best crickets I've ever cooked. <laughs> Look, the cook's always first. Oh, here, I'll show you. You want to try Julia? Oh, I have one. You'll get a single, you'll get a double. I'm going to get a single. Okay. They're pretty well done. Trust me. It's good. Crickets really taste good. Uh, Cricket tastes much cricket. better than the meal one. Yeah, we'll yeah. try a few times. I'm not going to eat the worm. I'm just going to wear them. Here, aren't I? Okay, let me show you. See, here's a cricket. This is a good one. This is a female. See, here's a cricket. Did everybody see it? Tastes like a nut. Very good. It's a nacho chip. <laughs> Is it good? Is it good? Don't look up and tell the lady what it's like. Austin. He's too busy eating it, huh? What does it taste like? It tastes like butter. Like butter. Oh, I mm. I want to see y'all eat them. Oh, no. No, thanks. Those are crickets. Yeah, that's sweet. Yeah, I like like the stuff. <laughs> Maybe you look sick. You don't like worms? You don't like worms? <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to eat it. You want to try anything else, though? You want to try a chip without a cricket on it? It's not a but you never had one. <laughs> what is that? That's a moral one out. Would you like yeah, that? You want to yeah. Stick your hand. Look on. Can I do it? Yeah. Can I do it? There you go. You take one right out. But each is like this. You can it. Let's see what else we can do. Three hundred million years old. We talked about that. I see this. 
here, this little leg here. This is the equivalent to this one. It's the same as this one. So this here, all of these have that, instead of having an antenna, have the data. See this? Actually what they do, they have it not to bite, they have it to bite the, the animals that they hunt to eat. Yes. And they put them to the poison and kill them and then they can eat them. In this case, they use it. You see that here there was one claw? How old are they? They can, in captivity, I've had them living a year and a half. Uh, my feeling is that they can be in the summer, probably also until somebody finds them. Eight plant material, uh, leaves, flowers, sometimes flowers. I thought there were a lot of crickets. There's quite an exhibit up here today. Let's move on. Any other questions? Are you saying cicada? That's quite different. Yeah, that's what do you think you feed them, Austin? And it has clear wings. Portable cricket cages for the pocket. How novel. Made in China. More good luck. That's sort of an apartment style. This is for the royalty. Kind of intermittent. Yeah, wasp caterpillars have been in They pop out, they spin their knees. This happens with the feckle. Yeah, yeah, you see pictures of their smooth bodies and all the ones. Yeah. 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 It kills them. And it's actually a good idea to save the wasps if you ever do get them, because then we can get a record of you know, what was feeding on the caterpillar. Who knows, it may be new information. Right, right, right. And they pop out fast, too. Yeah. You look at it. The well, emergence of the wasps, I think, is not until the next next cycle, next spring. That's a smooth caterpillar like this one right here. Have you got any questions about caterpillars? What you're looking at I think it's feet. No. Where you know what the hell is. I mean, don't push it. around it. That's how you... We learned how to collect. Before I started doing any collecting, um, I saw I started collecting by Or sit on one on this day. They have this very fine hair all over the body. They fly. Solitary. They're not a not a collar. Oh, is this again in the west or? Uh, these I think are from South Carolina. Whose relatives are being parted from that pattern to copy the motto. Yeah. And in the in Florida, in the southwestern southeastern U.S. You've got the queen, which is a relative of the monarch. It's also distasteful because it too feeds on milkweed as a caterpillar. And the viceroy, when it gets down into Florida, gets this color because it. This is much more common than the monarch down there, and so it's more beneficial to copy that. And this you is say distasteful. Who eats butterflies? Eats butterflies. Uh, birds. Yeah. Birds. And sometimes lizards. Yeah. That. This is in the same genus with the viceroy, and it, it again has departed from this pattern to look like that. This is the female of this species. Only the female is common. This is our common tiger swallowtail. And around here, about 
Forty percent of the females of the tiger swallowtail look like this, and again, they're mimicking that. The others look like the male, except for an extra amount of blue. Right. The evolution behind this, probably a good many billions of years. Yeah, many just for years. Are these moths or butterflies? These are butterflies. Moths here. Yeah. Why big butterflies? It's just the way they've evolved. These things as caterpillars make mines and leaves. So instead of well, that's Why don't you have a bunch of dumb milk? I bet they loved it. Uh, one could. See, so Vishai came down and printed that out on our colors. That little tiny speck of a wasp. Yeah. It's gigantic. Look at them. They're all beetles. Is this a real one right there, though? No. That's jewelry. That's pretend. It's kind of scary. Not yet. I think it's going to the collection. A friend of mine, I think it's his cat. They saw no sign. They feed on the lark. When did that? On the dark and oil and the dark. Do they fly? Yes. As I would hear, I was only in the, like, if I was up and walked through the room at 3 o'clock in the morning, everyone's okay. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah. They do fly. And they, and they don't fly very well. There's, um, this, the disadvantage beetles have is they have four wings, but only two, the hind wings, which are, are the flying wings. Mm -hmm. And the co front cover wings, though, are like shields. Yeah. In fact, the scientific name for beetle, coleoptera, means shield wing. And probably that's why beetles are more successful than any other insects, because they have these shields protecting their flight wings and their innards. Wouldn't want to be riding a wow. motorcycle. Some woman just came by and said she doesn't like beetles to be identified. Be Did he tell you what it was? Yeah, I've heard uh, that. You wouldn't People want to be riding a motorcycle. Okay, great. <laughs> 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 The jewel bug. Uh, you turn it into a piece of jewelry. But they keep it live, and they walk around with these live beetles on them. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Somewhere in Central America. Huh. Yeah. One out of I know that's a good job. Good. Good. <laughs> well, it's my So we try to divide it up like that. This is what she was drawing. Actually, uh -huh. this, right, this, right. And actually, I have the, this is not already finished, but it's very good. So that they can First timer. This so is the adult sawfly. Trying to get them to understand.